Hello fellow movers, today we are doing the all five stars in the Twilight Drone. This is, in my opinion, one of the hardest achievements in the game, the don't let anything fall off the edge. The deliver the flamingos to all the islands is easy and deliver all the flamingos is easy, but not let anything fall is not easy. It, it takes several attempts to not let anything fall because you're throwing boxes and just like that it's easy to knock those planters off or knock off any boxes so you have to be very precise how you throw these boxes you don't want to hit the drones when you throw them you don't want them rolling off the edge when you throw them you have to aim them just right and anticipate where they're going to land so they they don't roll off or knock another box off and it's sometimes better to move things out of the way but we're going to grab this flamingo and deliver it to all islands this one's probably easier than the other flamingo, in my opinion, but that's the one I do. And you don't want to jump on these backwards the first time around because it will knock those on that top middle island. It will knock them off. So if I rode this around the first time, I believe it'll knock everything off if I don't jump off right here. But I'm going to throw all these boxes to that island. And you don't need to worry about hitting the drones on this one. You can throw them right between the drones. Just aim it so that it it's as in the middle as you can so it doesn't roll off or knock another box off. If you want to take your time you can even move that tree or that plant and the, the other box out of the way ahead of time but I'm just going to take my time and aim things real careful like and it should be okay. And you also have to jump and throw the flamingo every time you throw it. Some some boxes you don't need to, but it's always it's usually a good idea. If it's close to the edge there, you want to jump and throw. Ooh, that was close. But taking that flamingo is a little bit easier than the other one. And yeah, that's quite a pile of boxes on that island. But we'll get to that later. And I just gotta grab the drone. I'll clean some of this up now. If you throw from this corner you don't need to worry about hitting the drone. If you throw from here you definitely have to worry about hitting the drone. You can do it either way. But just time it so that you're not going to hit the drone. And be careful when you're picking up boxes because they want to they want to knock it's easy to knock them off as you're picking them up but you want to start with those three islands and then we're going to take this flamingo we can jump over here and we just have to take the flamingo up to that top island up there but we need the planter to help us throw it so I'm going to leave that there for now move this planter to serve as like a extension so we can throw it a little bit farther. Throw that box. You don't want to jump and throw here because it will roll off. And if you can, aim it at the tree so it doesn't roll as much. Oh wow, that was close. I don't know how that box did not fall off. Got lucky there, but see that's why this this one is so hard. It's so easy to just bump something off the the map so, or off the platform. I'm gonna grab this box, the character crate. It makes it a little bit easier later to jump across. Saves a little bit of time. Get that flamingo. And we'll get that. That one we don't need to take to every island. So I'm just gonna throw it over here for now. But I'm gonna use this planter as an extension. I'll get that out of my way because gets in the way but if you line that up about halfway so the planter's half on half off you can use that as a plank to throw things and as long well as long as you don't grab it like that by accident but we'll set that up again no big deal we're not going through the pro time on this one just because you have to take your time throwing everything so there's no point in going for the pro time you'll have to do this one twice Jump and throw, grab the drone, now we're over here, get the last box, this one we can jump and throw, 
Ooh, that was close. But we'll get this other planner to line up so we can use that as a plank. If I can get that flamingo out from underneath of it. Yeah, you don't want to take any chances here, because any kind of wrong move and the flamingo will roll off or the planner will fall off. So you don't want to do it more than halfway. We can probably jump that gap, but I'm just going to throw it to be safe. Again, we're not going for a pro time, so we might as well just take our time on this on this one. Even take a drone for a lap. But we've got the flamingo on every island. We're going to deliver both of them. We've only got about three or four more items here to deliver without anything falling off, and we should be good to go. As long as I don't hit a drone there. Throw that. We'll throw that flamingo. Uh, anytime I throw the flamingo, I recommend jumping and throwing just because the flamingos don't tend to not make the, the tosses. And again, that character crate, you can use that to get across both of these islands here. So we're going to use that, save that for last. And be careful when picking items up because they tend to want to bump other items off. It's just the way it is. And that's why this one, you have to replay it so many times, you have to restart, because if you just bump one item or one box, oh boy, that was close. Or hit a drone while you're throwing it, it just, it'll fall in the water, you have to start over. So with this box, I can use that to jump that last gap. Just hold on to the box, don't let go, and you can get across. Saves a little bit of time from taking a drone. But as long as I get all these boxes in, nothing fell off that I saw. We delivered the flamingo to every island, starting with the top flamingo there, the top most flamingo. And I better deliver these flamingos before I deliver the last box. And we will have gotten all but the pro time. So we have to play, a lot of these levels you have to play twice to get all the five stars anyways. There we go. So we got the first three stars anyways. And we will do this again to do the pro time. There we go. Don't let anything fall. Take the flamingo to every island and deliver all the flamingos. Alright, now that we got the hard one out of the way, we can do the fun one. This is the pro time. And for this one, we ain't got to worry about anything falling off, so we can throw things and knock things and don't have to worry about anything. So we're just going to throw everything. We'll start with this island here. And when you throw this, be careful not to hit the wall of the truck, because it'll bounce off and land in the water. Or a drone. And we'll just kind of work our way around the islands and throw everything we can. go up to this island up here. This one is uh, probably the hardest one because you have to aim it between that tree and the truck there. If you aim it too close to the tree, it'll bounce off in the water. If you aim it too close to the truck, I don't think it'll make it. So we'll throw these three items here, but at least you don't have to worry about hitting any drones from this one. And then we'll get to the top, or I'm sorry, the far right island here. And there's one box on that island, so we gotta throw that one. And that one at least will throw into the middle island. And right. Now we go for a ride on the drone. And that bottom left island, we can jump from the bottom left island to the bottom middle island. We don't have to worry about throwing that box. But we can't jump from that middle island to the main island without the character crate. We'll just take the droning for a ride once we get these across, as long as I don't, my aim is good. We'll get those. This is the last one. There we go. So we just now will take the drony for a ride, load those up, and we will get a pro time. And that's the easy way to do it. You just throw it from the islands to the 
main platform except that far right island you can't do that and the bottom right or the bottom island that's the only two you can't do it in but there you go there's an easy way to get pro time and if you miss you just have to throw it again but it only costs you a few seconds and you don't have to worry about things falling so you got the hard one done and now we got the easy one done looks like our time will be 232 not bad so that's the easy way to get the pro time and the easy way to get the other achievements the falling off not that the falling off items falling off is easy, just that that's probably the easiest way I've found to do it. We got all five stars, pro time, and the character crate, just just for a bonus. Got another video about that too. Before you go, don't forget to check out our game guides for moving out too at FamilyGameSquad.com.